A participating carnival group has come forward stating that it has yet to receive subsidiary funds to properly prepare for the upcoming Junkanoo Carnival. Barabbas and the Carnival Tribe apparently does not yet have the resources needed to meet carnival obligations. Tonight, Ladon Davis talks to the chairman of the Bahamas Junkanoo Carnival, who is setting the record straight on the issue and the reasons for the delay in groups not being able to collect their checks and their subsidies. Junkanoo group Barabbas and the tribe, now Barabbas Carnival tribe, had to press the brakes on carnival preparations because of the lack of subsidy monies granted by the Carnival Commission. Group leader Quinton Barabbas Woodside says even though funding trumps those setbacks, group members are still pushing to meet their deadline. I say we already spent over $20,000 um, and we had to slow down because we don't have funds and we don't have sponsor. Um, uh, initially, we wasn't allowed to sell our costumes. We had to go through the Carnival Committee. But now, two weeks ago, they say we can sell our costumes. So that just threw us back because people would, would, would have put a down payment to us so we could have c continued doing our work. We would have been able to collect that money earlier. Is um, Boeing's House, the water company, Coca-Cola, food vendors. Mm -hmm. This is hard labor would be going through. Mm -hmm. If I have a bar right now, I sell... I sent six drinks. We're using the straw, the shells, the burlap. We're using sponge. And that we have to buy locally. So our costumes is going to be um, costly to, to produce. Um, I don't think we will be able to make like a, 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 a profit, like how they say. It's not as easy. It's not as butter as, as it looks. To, to the outside market. Now something like this, I would probably sell to my locals probably for 150 and, and cut the loss. But in the outside market, we will probably mark this up to probably about 250 to, to, to try and gain. So it is, rough, it is rough going off in the first half. Chairman of the Bahamas John Canoe Carnival Commission, Paul Major, says there are requirements that Barabbas and the Carnival Tribe and all of the other participating groups must meet before they can receive any subsidy from the government and the commission. I was with Barabbas yesterday because he called to tell me the same thing, and I called the secretariat uh, to determine why he would not have received his subsidy and was told that um, they had recited to him what he had to bring in to be able to get the um, subsidy check. And as it turns out, he has not given us the invoices to demonstrate that he has injected his capital of $5,000. And that could come in any form. It could be through having paid rent, utilities, staff, having bought materials. He can show us an, uh, uh, an invoice and a remittance. We sent some money to China or the United States to import goods. So any way he could demonstrate that he's put in his $5,000 capital we would then match that. Subsidy can range from $5,000 to at least $40,000, and that is only if you have 250 to 1,000 members or more in a participating group. Close to 12 groups have already signed up to participate in Carnival on May 7th through 9th. LaDawn Davis, ZNS Network News.